Hello everybody, welcome to another great episode of Hillbilly Select Reviews, where I review every kind of beer, wine, liquor, liqueur, and my world famous Sunday morning coffee reviews. Today we are doing Dogfish Head Sunday Feels. Mm -hmm. There it is. That label. It's important. It's important to the company at any rate. <laughs> All right, what is this here? What are we doing here? A laid back beer mosa, like a mimosa, sour brewed with peaches, grapes, and citrus. Peaches, grapes, and citrus, a mimosa type beer. Inspired by his favorite fruit forward brunch libations, the mimosa, the Bellini, and the screwdriver, to name a few. Sunday Fields is bursting with inviting aromas of fresh peaches, bright citrus, and of course, champagne. Crisp and spritzy, Sunday Fields began as a small batch beer available only in our Milton tasting room and kitchen. The beer is introduced to guests under a different name through our beer exploration journal during the summer of 219. After a surge of positive guest feedback, our... Um, Brewers carefully sifted through comments, tinkered with the recipe a touch, and thus Sunday Feels was born. Sunday Feels 221 packaging is part of our art series illustrations done by our 2021 art series artist, Ryan Besh. Ryan has been designing notable gig posters and vinyl art for 20 plus years, and his alternative comic inspired approach pairs perfectly with our off centered ales. ABV 6.5, IBU 15, and that's all we need to know. Style sour. Let's get to drinking this. Can we please get to drinking this? Why, of course we can. All right. Dogfish head. <coughs> What we got going on, folks? Look at that orange juice looking devil. That's supposed to be like mimosa, mimosa which is champagne and orange juice. Brewed with peaches, citrus, and grapes. Vignette grapes. It's a wine grape. Once again, orange color, nice white head. Peachy and citrusy. I'll give it that. Let's give it a taste. Before I get started, I've already got to start. Before I go any further, please subscribe. Hit it now. Go. Boom. Thank you. It's sour. I got that right. It's orangey. A little flat. A little bitter, which I don't understand because the IBUs were so low. So it is sour. It is orangey. It is a little peachy. It is bitter tasting. It is not bursting with flavor. It's not bursting with flavor, folks. I don't taste any of that uh, grape. I don't taste, I taste a little bit of peach. I taste mostly orange. It's got a, uh, almost a bitterness like the inside of a rind, whether it be orange, lemon, or grapefruit, that white part that has that bitter type taste without much flavor. Um, I'm not impressed. It's just not a lot of flavor here. It's just a bitter, a little dirty tasting. Well, you know, I would say 
Um, and I said it all. So <laughs> there it is. All right. I'm not crazy about it. I don't think it has enough flavor. Uh, it's very sour. It's okay. Uh, but the flavor is very lacking. And then what taste it does have is mild. But the greatest taste is a bitter, dirty, nasty taste on the finish. I don't particularly care for it. But I will finish it. Yes, I will. And uh, also, I uh, will see you on the next one. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you. And uh, oh, my playlists. My immense playlist where I have all my videos broken down so they're easy to find. You look at that playlist and you're going to be like, wow, this stuff sounds interesting. Some of it will because I guarantee something. One thing I always guarantee and that I, that is that I have something for everyone. And now I will see you on the next one. Thank you.